Oh, okay, here in this video, we'll be taking a look at a uh, multi touch test on the Nokia Lumia 930. I was just gonna see how it runs. I decided to do these videos for fun, you know, you know, see how well multi touch is and how well it works. So, we've got a multi touch application. We're gonna do two fingers first of all. You can see it tracks pretty well and it moves pretty um, nice and fluid. Uh, but once you start adding more, you'll start to see. So, when I add three, and this does detect up from all 10 fingers. Let me just show you really quickly. So let's put all 10 on. And you can see right there, it has detected all 10. Uh, but when you move them about all 10, you can see the colors do switch between one another. And you know, it kind of gets confused and kind of jumbles up a bit. But this is the case with most smartphones out there, including the HTC One M8. It does the exact same thing. So for the most part, it's pretty normal, four fingers. You can see it tracks it pretty well, no problem there. Let's add six fingers. Six fingers is pretty good. You can, it still tracks pretty well. It might switch um, between, um, you know, the colors might switch every now and then if you get like too close. But other than that, for the most part, it's still pretty fine. Eight. Eight is when it starts to get a bit. See, you can see it's kind of jumbling up a bit and kind of going crazy. But for the most part, you're not going to be using ten fingers on your screen at once. Um, so maybe four maximum, four maximum in everyday use, it's going to be fine. Uh, the multi touch is going to be fine. It's going to detect your fingers. If you're playing maybe a two-player game like um, air hockey or something like that, it'll work just fine. So yeah, that's just a quick look at multi touch on the Nokia Lumia 930. Let me know in the comment section down below. Tell me what you think. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and thanks for watching. Peace.